sorry, Miss Blair. No papers today. I think maybe 8H steal them again. Dorota, we both know that it was you, not Susan Lucci, who took my papers. But there's no point. It's all over the internet. What is? What are you reading? Chuck gave Ava a limited edition Bainoir Cartier watch. Gossip Girl even has a whole thread where people can guess how much it costs. How can she even see time through all that sparkly? I, I go get more coffee. How can I stomach going to his charity gala later? Uh, watching everyone ooh and ooh la la over that French floozy and that watch. Some are speculating it costs more than anything he ever gave me. I know it's hard to see Chuck with someone else. But you have to stop doing this to yourself. I'm just worried about him. We've seen this before. Strangers weaseling their way into our hearts. Clearly, Eva has an agenda. I'm guessing it's his money. You know, Eva actually seems nice, and even if she isn't, it's not your business anymore. Oh, and it's your business to be monitoring Nate and Juliet? And even worse, Humphrey and Dumpty? Fine. We're both having trouble moving on. But it was just so easy in Paris. You were so easy in Paris. Enough. But now... Now you're here and those boys are taken. For now. Yes, you're right. Maybe Dan and Nate will see the air of their ways and break up with those girls. Or they'll marry them and you'll die hitting refresh. Okay, fine. You know what? I will stay away from Nate and Dan. But you have to stay away from Chuck and Eva. No plotting, no meddling, no Blair Waldorfing. I'm not going to. I wasn't. I was going shopping. Anyway. Okay. Then I'm just gonna stay home and unpack all day. No gala. And tonight we'll watch Amelie and try to recreate our favorite cocktails from La Trey particularly. Deal? Deal.